Hello and welcome to this sneak preview of Auction SOS that Dan has asked me to present to you. Once you've downloaded your copy of Auction SOS and clicked on the Auction SOS icon on your desktop, you'll be presented with this screen that you see now in front of you. You'll see that there are five searches available um, and I'm today I'm going to show you my favourite which is the misspelled search. Now some of you may or may not know that quite often when sellers list things on eBay for sale they very often misspell the item whether it's out of stupidity or whether it's just a genuine mistake um, it doesn't really matter because at the end of the day if they've misspelt it it won't appear in searches that buyers do therefore they may not sell the item or it may go for a really cheap price well this is where you as the buyer come in because you can search for anything you like on this misspelled search and it will bring up all the misspelled items and then hopefully you'll be able to grab yourself a bargain so if we have a quick go here perhaps if we just type in say PlayStation and on the second box here you can choose which site you want to search um, I'm going to choose the UK site but there's Germany, India so on and so forth so you can search on all of them if if you really want to and then on the next box you can choose whether you want it to come up with a thousand maximum items a hundred I'm going to just choose 50 for our purposes today so we've got our searched for item we've got the site that we want to search on and we've got the maximum number of items that we wanted to search for so we click on search hopefully in the next few seconds this bar here will start to prog progress in blue and then yes there it goes and then once it's finished its search then all the 50 items that have been misspelt for PlayStation will appear down here the number of bids that are currently on those items will appear here and the current price that those items are at will appear here so here we go right so here we have 50 items pertaining to the word PlayStation that are all spelt wrong and if we have a look um, here plays there's a T missing there um, and there quite often yeah it's the T missing this one here says plat station so you know whether you're looking for a particular game or a console if you're looking for a game and say you can't find it at the price you want on a normal eBay search then it might be worth plugging it in here and searching for it and the chances are someone spelt it wrong and you might get it for a bargain price let's just try another quick search say Madonna if you're a Madonna freak so we'll search that here and here we go 50 items all with Madonna spelt wrong two D's there videos 99p 1D search down a bit more ah what's this two Madonna tickets spelt wrong two D's let's have click on, if we click on it then hopefully that particular eBay page will pop up taking a couple of seconds and here we have it two Madonna tickets spelt wrong so the chances are at 260 pounds and with three days to go and no bids you may well come away with two tickets to see Madonna look he spelt Madonna right there but wrong in the title just close that down so there we are you can type in anything you can type in Nokia if you're looking for a phone 
or Nike if you're looking for a pair of trainers or Louis Vuitton if you're looking for a nice gorgeous handbag let's try that one just out of interest to see if there's a lovely handbag that's going for silly money and here we go look Louis Vuitton small handbag going for five pounds now that's a bargain okay well I hope you've enjoyed this little sneak preview and I'm going to go now and look for some Jimmy Choo shoes thank you very much for listening bye